What's up guys, and today I'm going to be talking to you about Fighting Vipers for the Sega Saturn. Now, Fighting Vipers was a game that came out, I believe, in 1996 for the Sega Saturn, developed and produced by Sega internally. Now, this game, I'm going to say, playing this on an HDTV in 2018, this game still doesn't look half bad as much as classic 3D fighting games and classic 3D games in general usually look on an HDTV when running in 240p or 480i this game still kind of looks pretty colorful pretty beautiful now looks are one thing how does the game play now this game plays like your traditional mid 90s 3d fighter uh it's very arcadey it's very fun there's an arcade mode there's a multiplayer mode the one thing that makes this game very interesting though is its cast of characters now i played through the arcade mode as a lady named grace who she kind of has, like, rollerblades and stuff. You have other characters, like one, I think his name is uh, Raxel, who whooped my ass a few times. Um, he's like a rock star. So the characters in this game have very interesting uh, personality traits to them, which makes this game very unique, where it doesn't feel like everyone plays exactly the same. Now, other things that are cool in this game is you have kind of special turbo moves that do more damage. They're also, at points activate like an instant replay function and you can also hit your opponent out of the ring and I don't know if that's just done for dramatic effect when you do a knockout because most of the times that happened for me it was during a knockout sequence but it added to make this game very cool um now this game is one of the few Sega Saturn standout titles I would say because the Saturn here in North America really didn't do too well but this game being a Saturn exclusive, I think, you know, kind of showed off the 3D ability that a lot of people say the Saturn didn't have. Um, I know people say Saturn's 3D kind of look choppy, kind of look beat up. To me, it looks very Dreamcast-like to the extent where, like, you look at games like Dynamite Cop on the Dreamcast. It reminds me a lot of how this game looks. You know, it's not the prettiest thing, but it by no means is terrible looking. Um... Now, compared to fighting games of the modern day, does Fighting Vipers hold up? You know, it depends who you ask. If you're a fan of traditional, classic, 90s style arcade fighting games, I would say you're going to have a lot of fun with this, especially if you have a couple buddies around, you guys sipping on some cold ones, and just, you know, wanting to play a retro game and have a good time. You know, this game isn't as complex as a lot of games that um, go on, nowadays like street fighter 5 and all that however it does have a combo system there are different types of special attacks especially if you're playing with a six button saturn controller you get the ability to do a lot of different things there's grapple moves there's strikes there's power moves as i mentioned and overall i think fighting vipers in 2018 still holds up as a game that you would have a lot of fun playing either by yourself as like a little quick pickup or with a bunch of friends on a saturday night or a tuesday night or a thursday night you know whatever night the guys get together. Um, that's my little quick review of Fighting Vipers for the Sega Saturn. Do I recommend it? If you're a fan of arcade fighting games, I do. I think you'll have a lot of fun with this if you have a Sega Saturn. Now, the Saturn is probably going to be the more expensive part if you don't have one, because this game only goes for about $20, $25. You could probably get it cheaper. Uh, and the Saturn goes for like $60 to $80 at this point. Um, if you guys are getting into Saturn collector, collecting, collecting, I would say pick this one up as soon as possible because Saturn games, even the ones that aren't really sought after, are starting to go up in price. And Fighting Vipers, I think, deserves to be in the collection as a fun fighting game from 1996. That's my review. If you guys have played this game, leave your thoughts down in the comment section below. As always, like this video, share this video, subscribe to the channel, and go check out all my other videos. Until next time, guys, check out Fighting Vipers for the Saturn. Leave your thoughts below. Have a good one. Bye.